Hey guys, it's Chris of MyFashionJuice.com and today I'm going to be sharing with you 7 ways to wear the Urban Decay Naked 3 palette. Um, this is in no way sponsored by Urban Decay. I'm just going to be sharing with you 7 ways that I use my palette. I also have the Naked 2 palette and you can totally use these tips that I'm going to be sharing with you. Um, using that using this palette if you have the basic one the naked one palette you can use that too but I'm not sure if it has a rosy color because one of the way that I'm using my palette is to use as a blush so just a summary before I start the seven ways I use my naked three is um, for my eyebrows um, to line my eyes or as a water liner. Um, three is the usual eyeshadow. Um, number four is a highlighter. Number five is as a contour. Number six uh, as a blush and number seven as a color. So if you have like your usual lip gloss and want to try out something different but don't want to spend on new makeup or a new lipstick uh, why not layer it with um, one of the shades from the Naked 3 palette? So, um, let's begin! The first way I use a Naked 3 palette is for my eyebrows. Start filling in your eyebrows with a dark side shade and try to go as natural as possible. Go with swift, short strokes to mimic the hair. Using a spoolie brush, comb your eyebrows upwards and sidewards from the inner to the outer corners of your eyebrows. Using the same dark side shade, the second way I use the Naked 3 palette is to waterline my eyes. I love waterlining the eyes. You can tell a huge difference. The waterline one pops out and looks more alive. Using the same shade, line the top and bottom of your eyes. The third way I use my Naked 3 palette is as an eyeshadow. Take the factory shade and start brushing your eyelid from the outer corner to the inner corner as if you were trying to fill your eyeball. Take a shimmery shade like the Buzz and fill in from the inner corner to the center to add dimension to your eye. Now take a lighter shade such as a dust and apply it on the center of the eye to give it more dimension, like a 3D look. Then just blend everything together. Now for the fourth way of using the Naked 3 palette, take the lightest shade which is called the Strange and use it as a highlighter. Apply it underneath the eyebrows and using a clean finger apply it on top of your eyebrow and make a letter C around the outer corner of your eye. Highlighting the face gives you that dewy glowing look and it highlights your bone structure so you don't look flat in photos. Since we are doing a contour later, it's also nice to highlight the center of the nose to make it appear taller. Add a highlighter on your cupid's bow as well. And you can also use your brush, just clean it up to add that highlight to the cupid's bow and to the center of your nose. As well as the inner corners of the eye to make you look more alive. 
For the fifth way of using the Naked 3 palette, take the Factory or Nooner shade and use as a contour. Do a duck face and follow the hollows of your cheekbones, as well as a jawline. and the chin. Now draw two lines on either side of the nose to make it appear smaller. Take a brush and start blending away until the lines are no longer visible. Use a blending sponge to make the blending faster and easier. Double check and use the fingers if you have to. Now let's put on some lipstick. I'm using Tory Burch in Saucy. But what if you want a different shade and don't have that lip color? My sixth way to use a Naked 3 palette is as a lip color. Take a shade you like, I'm using the limit, and apply over your lipstick. For my 7th way of using the Naked 3 palette, take the Buzz shade and use as a blush. So that was my 7 ways to wear the Naked 3 palette. I hope you enjoyed this uh, beauty tutorial and if you'd like to see more please like this video um, and I hope to see you soon and please visit myfashionjuice.com thank you and bye